Today, doctors testing a groundbreaking treatment for some of the side effects of cancer reported what they called very impressive results. Here's our chief medical correspondent, Dr. John LaPook. After Dinah Baser was treated for ovarian cancer in 2010, the next two years were filled with dread. All I thought about was the cancer, that it would come back and I would die of it. How severe was the anxiety? Were you able to go on with your life? I felt like it was destroying my life. Yeah, I mean, sometimes... In 2012, Baser entered a study to treat anxiety and depression in cancer patients using the hallucinogenic drug psilocybin, the active ingredient in certain mushrooms. Dr. Stephen Ross directs addiction studies at NYU Langone Medical Center and led the study. The idea was that uh, drugs which were known to induce spiritual or these unusual mystical states of consciousness might help people who are having this domain of distress. Baser took the medication in this treatment room with therapists present for support. During this session, she saw her fear yes. inside her body. And as soon as I visualized the fear, I became furious. In my mind, I screamed, who the hell do you think you are? I won't be eaten alive. From that moment, the fear was gone. You took control. I took control, and it was gone. The NYU study and the second one at Johns Hopkins followed a total of 80 patients for six months after a single dose of psilocybin. There was lasting reduction of anxiety and depression in 60 to 80 percent of the patients. I began to feel the most amazing love I have ever felt. I think my brain was rewired a little bit, and that love that I felt has done very well, very, very good things for me. There were no serious side effects. Though encouraging, these results are definitely preliminary. And for now, the drug remains banned, except for research. And Scott, Dr. Ross told me that the FDA is expected to consider within the next two months whether or not to approve a larger study. What an amazing result for Dinah. John, thanks very much.